the majority of daily transport by passenger cars, meanwhile, are short journeys from home to work or school. Such short trips are the easiest to replace with alternative, emission-free modes of transport. But still only few people use electric bicycles or e-bikes for their daily transport needs. To encourage more people to take emission-free transport modes, more attractive alternatives are clearly needed. The shift to electric will open up all sorts of new vehicle types and we found this one super interesting. Should we have a look together? Number 1 Archimoto, the fun utility vehicle. The recent rise of electric vehicles continues to percolate new ideas about how to better get around in our modern society. And one of these are Archimoto vehicles. It's an unusual three-wheeled tadpole-style EV with two seats and a roll cage. Archimoto produced a single-seat delivery version of the fun utility vehicle as well as special light versions. There is also a sporty roadster version without the roll cage. But the base is a two-seater that looks like it's made for having a good time rather than slugging out grocery runs. It has two wheels in front and one out back, seats two people front to back rather than side to side like the Polaris Slingshot and runs on electricity that powers two front motors, one for each front wheel. It's 80 inches across and 113 inches long. So, while it has a footprint, it's still fairly small compared to even a compact car. It has a motorcycle style handlebar and twist throttle rather than a steering wheel and gas pedal. And it is classified as a motorcycle in Oregon. However, since it is in full enclosure, you are not required to wear a helmet to drive it or ride in it in Oregon. This machine had no doors, but doors are an option. A color LCD panel keep you apprised of speed, battery level, time, range, distance traveled and other data bits. There was an optional rear trunk compartment on my review machine as well as heated seats and heated hand grips which are standard. A built-in Bluetooth stereo with small marine speakers is a bit short on bass but loud enough to sing along with your favorites. Brakes are hydraulic discs all around. LED projection headlights and LED brake and marker lights give the FUF excellent nighttime illumination and visibility. Plus, you might say it, it kind of stands out in the traffic. The twin motor setup produced 77 horsepower to push the 1,300 pound FUF in range stretches from about 35 freeway miles to over 60 miles of mixed city highway driving to about 100 miles if you're going to stick to city streets. It recharges using level 2 quick chargers or you can plug it in like a toaster to a wall outlet with the included adapter. It takes longer to charge the way but that's what I did and woke up each morning to a full charge. Number 2. The Vimo SE – Urban Transport Reimagined Vimo allows you to lower your carbon dioxide footprint while getting you there faster. Easily commute to work and back without the typical worries or weather and the need for shower. Vimo's electric motor assist and the constantly variable rear hub automatically change gears from you based on the challenges of the road and your riding style. This allows Vimo to carry additional cargo, payloads, 
lights and still fly up steep hills while optimizing battery range. Vimo's electric power assist provides the rider with the energy to travel further and faster than non-power assisted Velo mobiles. The pedal assisting power is paired with a stepless shifting rear hub that provides smooth and stress-free riding. Using a zero-emission vehicle like Vimo is one of the single most impactful action any person can do to lower their greenhouse gas footprint and combat climate change. This is all done while offering a top speed of 20 meters per hour in USA and Canada and 25 kilometers in the EU. While this does not sound fast to some, keep in mind that the average speed of most commutes in North America historically was around 26.5 miles per hour and has been falling every single year since 2001. Vimo's battery is rechargeable using any electrical plug-in connection and provides a range of travel of up to 70 kilometers for 43 miles per change. Chargers are optimized and compatible for many different electrical systems based on country. This means you can commute up to 43 miles plus 70 kilometers per second to work, plug in your battery to recharge and ride the same distance on the way home. Vimo takes you out of the rat race and places in the bike lanes where agility and efficiency are celebrated. The Vima SE is not much larger than a mountain bike at 200 cm long, 89 wide and 150 high and is approved for travel within bike lanes in most jurisdictions. Get out of vehicle traffic and into the bike lane where life is faster, more enjoyable and on time. Vimo was designed and tested in the beautifully soggy Pacific Northwest famous for its abundance of rain, of course. Bad weather doesn't keep active people inside and small transportation choices need to account for all types of weather by protecting the driver and cargo from the elements. With rain, sun and windshield in enclosure, riders stay dry, comfortable and happy, as does their clothing. Number 3 Finnish built Kinner Velomobile. Finnish Kinner is like a human powered classic car. The two seater four wheeled Kinner is certainly one of the most exquisite we've seen so far. Kinner is first of all human powered vehicle. Electric assistance makes the low speed driving easy. With its composite chassis and road bike wheels, the Kinner is very light and moves with very little effort. The current prototype is 285 centimeters long, 100 centimeters wide and has a 220 centimeters wheelbase, allowing it to be legally classified as an electrically assisted bicycle, well at least in Finland. Among other things, it sports lightweight fast rolling road bike wheels, a composite chassis with a hinger forward opening hood for easy access, padded bucket seats and an airplane style. Would you prefer to exercise with companion on a bicycle? You only have your body weight to help turning the crank. There, it sits in better driving position in the Kinner car, so you get lots of more power to use easily. Think about bench press. Other planned features of the projection model include an integrated electronic system with a pin code activated anti-theft function. The ability to swap in more robust gravel bike wheels, plus optional side windows, mirrors and a full LED lightning system. All of the composite parts will be made of fiberglass, carbon fiber or a green bio-based material. Number 4 Northern Lights Motors Northern Lights 428 
Former auto designer Graham Browney, who drew the plans for the TVR Tuscan convertible, launched the British startup Northern Lights Motors. It has been praised as the future of personal transport. The Northern Light Motors e trike which resembles a Velomobile, is available in a variety of configurations. The least expensive 428 Blue model is pedal assist only, has a 10-speed gear derailleur and has hydraulic disc brakes. The 557 Green, which is the next model up, adds a 10.5 ampere battery, an electric motor with power outputs ranging from 250 watt to 750 watt. Consequently, a range of 50 miles and a top speed of 40 miles per hour are claimed. Other tech features include a removable roof and LED light. The 630 red is the model at the top of the range. The 48 watt 20 ampere battery and 1.5 kilowatt hub motor in the fully electric model give it a claim range in excess of 40 miles and a top speed of 28 miles per hour. The 630, the top model in the lineup, also has a performance ties and brakes. Tech features include a dedicated mobile app and a Bluetooth smartphone connectivity. Well, let's say a simple vehicle with key ingredients, weather protection, some safety, some luggage and the key forward. Number 5 B Triton. B Triton is your ultimate vehicle to get to nature and immerse yourself in the wilderness. Witness the magic of the most beautiful places on this planet in a completely new way. This amphibious idiot will carry you around over land and water and will provide a well sheltered tiny home almost anywhere on this planet. Discover places regionally and put B Triton on a trailer to get to four-way places. There is so much to see and discover in this unique way. When you first see the Z Triton 2.0, you may find yourself wondering whether this strange looking vehicle is a boat, a trike or some kind of micro shelter and it's a yes, yes to all three. B Triton is a fully electric recreational vehicle and combines three functions, a hardtop motorboat, cargo tricycle and a tiny camper that sleeps two people. This is a completely new 3-in-1 concept providing the most continuous and immersive outdoor travel experience. The 3-in-1 vehicle allows you to explore the world on land and water and even offers room for sleeping. In tricycle form, you can either pedal or use electricity to power the pair of 250 watt motors. There's room for two grown-ups. Turning the Z-Triton into a boat is an easy job. It's lift up the wheels of the bike, inflate and attach stabilizers, lower the electric boat motor from the cabin and off you go. The entire procedure takes less than 5 minutes. Can you imagine that? Less than 5 minutes from boat to bike, from bike to boat. And don't worry about running out of electric energy for the motor. There are attachable O's as an alternative way of propelling the Z Triton. Last but not least, there's a camper mode. So we got a bicycle, a boat and a camper. The best thing about it is that it works both on land and water, which basically means you can spend the night in the middle of a lake. Oh my god. The Latvian company premises it's spacious enough for two grown-ups to sleep comfortably. There's a solar panel on the roof that provides energy for the built-in Bluetooth speaker. Probably the weirdest feature, however, is the pot on the roof that allows you to take your favorite plant on a trip with you. 